The last two skaters has to go out. So, just before the start. And they're off. So, all the skaters will take their position now. They're off really <laughs> slow, really slow. So, the skaters in the back are coming It's a bit to different compared to the 1,000 meter. Yeah, it's really slow. And who skates in the front? Is that Marika Tung? Yeah, it's Marika Tung from Germany. Yesterday uh, she won a thousand meter. She had tears after the after her win. It was her first individual world title. Yeah, she took already gold with her team. I think two years ago, or maybe last year, with the German team, and now she took the first individual gold. Uh, they took last year the third, the bronze medal in the relay. So in the front we see now Sandrina Tass, followed by uh, Francesca Lolo Bricida and the two Argentina girls Martos and Herrero. So when the board is on 43, we ring the bell for the first points. Yeah, and here we hear the song from uh, Walter Cruz for the Dutch fans. In the crowd there are a lot of that Dutch fans. So the two Colombian girls are in the front now. They will try to keep there until the first sprint. But they're slowing down, so it's yeah. still three laps to the first points. Today they might race for Fabriana Arias, the other Colombian girl. And we see Elzumika van Maren moving up now to the first position on the outside. Or she will keep skating the second line. Yeah, and behind her is uh, the girl from India, Arata Katuri Rice. I hope I pronounced it okay. And Elzumika van Maris in the Koppositie nu. Ja, dat is toch mooi. Uh, Elzumika van Maris tijdens haar eerste WK ooit uh, pakt brutaal de leiding. Yeah, can she get a place now in front? Yeah, a lot of girls passing now. Yeah, and they're going to the first bell. That means the first points are in one lap to go. Jan, Elzemieke rijdt met haar hand op het op haar rug in het peloton. Is dat slim? Het is niet heel slim. En ondertussen gaat de eerste puntensprint naar Sandrine Tas uit België. Of wordt het Francesca Lolo Brigitte oh, Duitsen? Big... It's a big fight already, but I think Francesca took it. Yeah, first points for Francesca Lolo Bricida and one point for Sandrine Tass from Belgium. So Francesca still in the lead. Behind her it's Marijke Toom and the two Colombian girls, but the Dutch girls are also there. So it's Francesca who wants to take a lead immediately and try to take the first two sprints. Can she take it down or is there Marijke Toom? Yeah, and we see Francesca Lolo Bricida another two points, Toom one point. So the Colombian girls are waiting a little bit and in the meanwhile we see also the other Italian girl in the front. Colombia girl Arias is leading now and they go to the bell and there will be a next point sprint. Yeah, but Jan, this is not on only points. We see the girl from India who has to leave the race. Number 55, Rachita Rachita is the first one who eliminated. Yeah, it's a big battle up front and it's a big battle in the back of the peloton. We see now the Colombian girl number 31 is leading. Fabriana Arias took the two points in front of Lord of Vigida. Yeah, and we see Kira Yasutaka from Japan who has to leave the race and Dominika Gardi from Hungary. And we yeah. also see the other Japanese girl, Yuri Yoshino, who has to leave the race. And for the first time this race we see Dan Huao in the front of the pack. He will try to get the first two points, followed by the French girl. Yeah, and Maria Herrero from Argentina is out now. Dan Juan takes the first two points, and one point goes to the French girl, number 41, Clemence Habo. So we see after, after every spin, the peloton slows down a little bit, 
And then the bell goes and they're speeding up again. Yeah, we see a girl from Hungary in the back of the peloton. Oh, and the judges have a hard time to get out all the skaters who are eliminated. So now we see Marika Tooms. He tries to take the two points just in front of Spanish girl, number 84, Mati Ansen. So we have to look at the back of the peloton now. There is Maya de Jong from the Netherlands. There's too much in the back. And, and it's a double elimination still, so... So maybe she's out, we're not sure, but we think she's out. Yeah, Maya de Jong from the Netherlands is out, and also Melissa Perry from USA. Yeah. And in the meanwhile, number 31, Fabrina Arias, I think took the first two points just in front of Francesca Lollobrigida. Uh, Lollobrigida made a hawk, so took she it. took the two points. She's leading with seven points now. Arias and Tum got both three points. Oh, and the two girls from Chinese Taipei are leading now. They also want to get points. Yeah, we see the other girl from USA, Kelsey Hellman, also in the back now. She eliminated with a rush from India. So Chang and Yang are leading now, and they're taking the points. The two girls from Chinese Taipei. Number 21, Yang takes two points, and Chang takes one point. So they're still in the lead, but the Colombian girls are behind the two skaters from Chinese Taipei. Maybe they will try to get another point. Yeah, we see the girl from Mexico eliminating now. And number 50, Vanessa Mimi Wong from Hong Kong. And we see the girl from Korea, 82, taking the points now. Yu Suk Wu. So and one point for Fabriana Arias. She's having four points now. Still in the lead, Francesca Lola Brichida with seven points. Yeah, and Francesca is at the moment in fourth position. She's behind the Colombian girls, and they're going to the line now, four points. And we are in the single eliminations now, and Nacha Wenger is out. Dominica Gardi is leaving the race now too. She eliminated a few laps ago. Ja, en ondertussen zien we de Nederlandse Elsa Mieke van Maren nog knap in de wedstrijd. Ze zit uh, ergens halverwege in het peloton nu aan de buitenkant. Ze moet zorgen dat ze niet als laatste over de finish komt. No, she's okay. We see a girl from Korea in the front and a girl from Korea in the back. And Chinese Taipei is attacking again with a number 24, Yu Xin Chang. Ja, yeah, Chang is taking the points in front of the girl from South Korea. This is Hoisik Wu. And she's continuing her attack. And the Colombian girls has to react now. And you see they are racing for Arias as Viveros is closing the gap now. So and Viveros is closing the gap. And they're hearing the bell for the next points. In the back we see the German girl. I think it's Sabine Berg. Yeah, it's Sabine Berg from Germany. Oh, and there are the two Colombian girls. Who takes the points? It's Fabriana Arias, and she has eight points now, which means one point more than Francesca Lolo Brichida. And Sabine Berg and the Spanish girl, Mayalen Oñate, are having a hard time. So it's a close battle between Francesca Lolo Brigida and Fabriana Arias. Now we see Sandrine Taz in the lead in front of Dan Guo. Sandrine Taz no medal so far in this tournament. Yeah, she has only one point so far, so, so she has to take a few yeah, points. Yeah, but now Dan Guo takes two points again. She's on four points now, which yeah. means third position. And Sandrine Taz took one point. Elze Mieke van Maren doet het erg goed, zit nu op de elfde positie in peloton. So we in the, see in the lead now the girl from Taipei, Chang. Oh no, Yang is leading the pack now in front of Hua. 
And we see three girls off the pack. And another girl from Chinese Taipei is going for points now, but Arias is not giving her, her the points. So Arias takes two points and Yang takes one point. Yeah, Arias got three po more points compared to Francesca Lolo Bricida. Who in a South Korean girl clearly took the line by one skate, but I don't think the judges will do something. Sabine Berg is out of the race now. So there is Francesca Lorde oh, in the front again. We see Fiveros taking her points. Yeah, the Colombian girls are performing really strong another time. Yeah, so. Eight points for Lola Brichida now. And Arias has 10 points, so it's still close with 15 laps to go. Oh, and Arias is taking the lead now. Fifero is behind her. Clemence Hobo from France is taking over. And 24 and 36 has to leave the race because of a two big gap to the peloton. Yeah, and a nice tactic from the Colombian girls. Number 31, Arias is leading the race and will now in a breakaway. Work, will they work together? No, Clemence has to do it. So, and Francesca Lollobrigida has to chase now the breakaway. It costs a lot of energy without getting a point. So we go to the bell again. Yeah, and we see the Korean girl with 82. She had already three points, but she's out. Ja, dat is altijd het lastigste van de avondkoers. Net als Elsa Mieke van Maren heeft Elsa Mieke het nu heel erg lastig. Ze moet het peloton laten gaan, maar ze heeft een fantastische wedstrijd gereden. Yeah, we see Francesca Lollobrigida in the lead now. She took two points, 10 points now for her, 12 for Fabriana Arias from Colombia. Now we see the other girl from France, Juliette Puydeba. Yeah, it's really front. close, really close. Elimination, Clemence Hobo in the back of the peloton. But Elzemika Famara has to leave the race. So with 10 laps to go, Arias is leading the peloton now, but Sandrina Tass is coming from the outside and will take the first two points in front of Arias. Oh, no, no. Yes, yeah. Sandrina Tass takes the first two points. One point for Arias. And they're all dead. I mean, they don't have energy left for a breakaway or taking points. Clemence Hobo is out as well. She also had three points. So the Colombian girls are going to the front. Arias is leading and she will probably get another two points just in front of her teammate, Fiveros. So she's leading now the race in front of Francesca Lola Brigida. Yeah, 15 points now from for Arias and five for Viveros. We yeah. also see uh, still two Chile girls. They don't have points so far. So with six laps to go, we go for another sprint. And Marika Toom is from the outside. She has a lot of speed, but I think she's too late to get points. Or maybe not, oh, maybe not. She's having a lot of speed. She's going. She will attack again. Yeah, she will do a, a thousand meter. Five laps to go. She's Fabriana world champion. Fabriana Arias, two points. Yeah, Tum is racing for the third place. So five laps to go. Five laps to go. Marika Tum in the lead in front of the Colombians, and then Francesca Lorla Brigida. Who will get the points now? Juliette Puydeba is out of the race. She crossed the finish line as last person. Toom took two points in front of Arias. So there are, is only one elimination left. That will be the girl from Chinese Taipei. So with the bell, us. the bell on three. Sandrina Tass is leading. She will try to get a few points, points more. Yeah, 
the girl from Chinese Taipei is eliminated. So Arias takes another, another two points and she is leading now. I think she will be the new world champion on this distance. Yes, she, has she too will many be. Points. She no will eliminations be. anymore. So and Fiferos, one lap to go and Fiferos is in the lead. If she takes the three points, I think she can become second. No, no, she can become third. She got five points so far. And Francesca Lolo Brecci that got ten points. So we have Johanna Viveros winning the last sprint, which means eight points for her. Sandrine Tass took the two points, seven points for her. And the girl from Chile with number 13, one point, her first and last point. So we have Fabriana Arias in first position, gold medal to Colombia. Second place for Francesca Lola Bricida from Italy and third place to Johanna Viveros from Colombia.